At the Arabian Travel Market, the first in-person event in the region and in the world, in fact. We're taking a look at uh, trends when it comes to travel and Sudir from Fly Dubai. Start off, you've got some star destinations in your, on your uh, patch. Yes, I mean, we, one, thing, one trend that we've just now seen is that holidays are back. Yep. People are you know, frustrated. I think they course, want to get yeah. out. And yeah. uh, the new norm is social distancing. So we see people are now heading to resorts. And we see that happening in Maldives and Zanzibar. People want chalets and people want space. and So that's the new customer on the holiday side. So you're so, responsible for those star destinations of Zanzibar, short flying time, really, direct flight, right. and also the Maldives. So right. uh, what's the traffic been like over the recently Eid holidays for you? Well, as I said, people want to get out, right? And so while we see staycations happening in UAE, which we have catered for on holidays, we're also seeing people wanting to get out and beach destinations promise us some distance. So as I told you, at Fly Dubai, we have ensured that safety on board is, is there, the aircrafts are clean, sanitized, is hygiene, but the customer now wants destinations where they can explore some space and, you know, and they can be left with their families. And we respect that. And we see those new families now coming uh, to Maldives and to Zanzibar, and the numbers are increasing. So that's a good start, uh, especially from Malaysia, slowly sure, creeping yeah. their way back as we expect to come out of this crisis. And of course, uh, Fly Dubai has a holiday section and division, so holidays by Fly Dubai. What does it mean if you book a package rather than sort of do it yourself with flights and separate bookings for hotels? Well, the good thing is that our experienced people have monitored the trends of what the customer needs. So we have packaged everything together. So it's a one-stop shop. All your requirements vis-a-vis uh, -vis your hotel, vis-a-vis -vis the way you want your rooms, vis-a-vis -vis the way you want to accommodate your children, all that's taken care of and it's a it's a, it's, a, it's a whole price, uh, but most important is the flexibility we allow for our customers to make their uh, changes and to ensure that you know, we're able to get them what they want. So with the package, you've got that advantage, that flexibility, because if you do it yourself, you've got to change the flight, you've got exactly. to change hotel yeah. bookings, transfers, a whole lot. And plus, it's and all, when you do it yourself, it's all piecemeal, and you don't know yeah. where to go for what. Sure. Here you come to us, and we'll sort that out for you in most so cases. So that's one of the other trends, the packaged aspect of holidays, which in this part of the world is a bit different to Europe, where Europe is really sort of geared up to packaged holidays. It's perhaps, a, you know, for a lot of people, a new concept here, and it's taking off here. Well, Europe has always been a different market because you know you see more people doing inclusive tours, they go in groups, you know, and that trend will continue. But here we see more families, more individuals who want to travel with their, uh, with their loved ones and they would love now to ensure that someone takes care of all the complexities because, because Phil, travel is not the same as before. It certainly isn't so, it, you know, all the formalities and all the documentations have to be taken care of and I think be quite well catered for the holidays to do that. So moving ahead, you've had the busy period of the Eid holidays, looking towards summer, you're launching a number of summer destinations. So in your territory, what can we expect? Well, I must tell you this, you know, pre-condemic, pre-pandemic, the trends have changed, right? Post-pandemic, uh, we don't expect to see routine trends. We would see uh, a wavy kind of business where we have right. opportunities and a blip and opportunity blip. So yes, we're geared up for summer, uh, there's some exciting destination that we have that we opened up. We have opened up some new routes in Russia, but as I said, the customers changed. So we need to be ensure that we are agile to be able to cater to them as they come out, sure. be it an air bubble or be the opening of air skies. Okay, so you have that flexibility, and it's been good talking to you here at the Arabian Travel Market, talking in person. None of these screens, no more zooming at the moment. So thanks it is, very much. It is, it is, but we'll we'll get out of this. Thank you. Phil. <laughs>